Hello everyone, welcome to Kelvin's Coin TV. My name is Ross. Today we are playing Heroes of Might and Magic 2, doing what we like to call death matches, where we pit one army against another. Twitch chat is here live, bidding channel points. If you're watching on YouTube, feel free to play along. In our first matchup, we have 175 giants versus 155 bone dragons. A starter prediction, keep in mind that there is no spell casting involved, no artifacts. We're gonna auto resolve all the battles. Let's start it up. Picks are in, let's see who takes it down. Giants or the bone dragons. I believe the bone dragons will get the first hit. Let's see why. Giants have a lead. And they take it down. Congratulations if you voted for the Giants. You win. Our next matchup features 450 Master Swordsmen versus 1,000 Gargoyles. Let's start that prediction up. Master Swordsmen versus Gargoyles. Hey -o! Of course, Gargoyles get the first hit since they fly. And they're faster anyway. Ooh, hit the others off them. Master Swordsman will be dealing more damage. Or maybe not. They're quite beefy. They have that high defense skill. Hanging in there. Gargoyles have a pretty big lead, though. Don't think they're going to give it up. And this one goes to the guards. Congratulations, if you voted for them, you win. Our next matchup is a battle of range units. We have 105 war trolls against 11 titans. Now they're both really tough. Titans are, of course, are the second most powerful thing in the game. The numbers of the war trolls have to sustain them here. They also regenerate, but I don't think that's gonna matter given how much damage titans deal. Let's start a prediction, see what you think. Picks are in. Boulder throwers or lightning launchers. Let's see who takes it down. Howie. Oof. War trolls hanging tough. Six titans left. Down to five. Oh, they're not dealing enough damage. They're not taking out enough trolls. Oof. Titans going down. And it's the war trolls. The boulder beauties. Congratulations, if you voted for War Trolls, you win. That was fun. Our next matchup, we have 400 Royal Mummies against 250 Earth Elementals. Let's start a prediction. Paper versus rock. <laughs> Royal Mummies versus Earth Elementals, or as Chad just said, Paper versus rock. Let's see who takes it down. Now, Earth Elementals are not immune to being cursed. Oof, a lot of damage. There we go. Just look how brown everything is. Oh, mummies are trying to stay on top. Despite the amount of damage Earth Elementals are dealing. The uh, curse is really keeping them in this. You gotta keep that up. Oh boy. Earth Elementals are starting to close the gap. They might take a lead. They won't relinquish here. Oh wow. One unit separated them right there. Wow. And there you have it, Earth Elementals, take it down. Our next matchup features a 2v2. We have 20 Phoenixes, Phoenixes, 400 Goblins together against 25 Cyclopes and 100 Pikemen. Start a prediction. 
picks her in. Let's see if Team Phoenix Goblin can take down Cyclopes Pikeman. The inverse will happen. Auto. a problem for the pikemen. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh jeez. Oh god. And there they go. <laughs> wow. Wow. Congratulations, you voted for the Phoenix Goblin team. You win. Our final matchup is the two and a half million maniac challenge. The ones taking it on this time. 125,000 nomads. Let's start a prediction. Picks are in the sea if they can win the challenge or if they're going to go down to the scythes the working class out of result flying bee <clears throat> oh. oh that's a lot of nomads going down oh it's going to be close oh there's 31,000 one left oh no can the peasants hang on oh they just pull it off Peasants take it down. The Nomads fall just short of beating the two and a half million maniac challenge, but better luck next time, bitches. That will do it for this episode of Heroes of Might Magic 2 Death Matches here on Kelvin's Coin TV. Thank you all for watching. My name is Ben Ross. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.